Hello folks, it is August 16th, 2021. I am with Brianna. We are in Algonquin Provincial Park and we are gonna go do a night backcountry in the canoe. We're at Cache Lake and we're gonna head that way to Lake Tanamacoon. So we just parked right here and then we're gonna canoe south and go through this inlet where there might be some moose. Now we're gonna take one of these six sites. We are off. Wanna push this off? Yeah, just take that. Yeah, that Canadian flag. Yeah. Bree's first backcountry trip. Tana Macoon. Coming in? Nice. Lots of loader boats on this lake and cottages. Here is a look at Cache Lake. Some neat little cottages on it. Okay, we're 1.3 kilometers in. We're just heading down that inlet now to Lake Tanamacoon. Tanamacoon. It's hard to pronounce. Pretty peaceful indeed. Been looking out for a moose. Okay, here's the first site we came across. We're gonna check it out. We're like 2.6 kilometers in. Here we are. We're going to stay at this one. It's pretty good. No bugs around. It's open. Easy entry point to the water here. And we can go swimming. Pretty short paddle. We're only 35 minutes for 2.69 kilometers. But here we are. So we parked the cache lake there and went through that inlet into Lake Tanamacoon. Oh look, there's a speedboat on the satellite picks. We're all set up. Brought that little blue tent, five pound tent. We like that one, it has two doors, so we don't have to crawl on each other to get out of the tent. Nice little spot. And here is a nice tent area. So now you're allowed up to nine people maximum on these sites, but this one could easily accommodate it. Find some of the sites are too small, there's not enough spots for that many tents. This one's pretty good. Here's our own private little beach. Take a look out, hear people coming. Let's go check out the Thunderbox. Here it is. This one looks like it's a little rough. Okay. Well, I don't know where it is now. Pretty open in here, I like it. Could see a bear coming. Well, Bree, how's it going so far? Finding wood for the fire so we can cook. Yeah. Took the bow saw up there. There's a big eastern white pine. Probably fell down sometime last year. Fire's going good now. We had a swim. Water's pretty warm. We'll cook up some food. It is five o'clock. We're cooking up some dinner. Bree's doing her dogs on the fire. I'm gonna do some in here. I already boiled us the noodles. We drain some of that water and then put the spice packages in. It's gonna be good, then we're gonna go for a canoe ride. And 
here it is. We don't have forks or spoons. <laughs> Horrible job packing. <laughs> oh well, we're making do. So we just left the site over there. We can see another site over there. But here is the island one. No one's on it tonight. And we're thinking there's less bugs on there. Not that the bugs are bad this trip so far. But there'd be no firewood on there. So you have to bring some in the canoe from who knows where. And we just decided to take the first one we found. Right over there is the camp. And we heard like, it sounded like a church bell earlier. I was guessing that it's a dinner bell. I don't know if there's kids there or it's an adult camp. I'm not even sure. I should look it up. Oh, hear everyone? Yeah. Definitely kids. Beaver. It just splashed his tail like by the shoreline. I thought it was a Sasquatch throwing a rock into the lake. But no, I hear her running wired behind us by the portage, so I think it was trying to alert us that this is its territory. Maybe over there. Oh, there it goes again. <laughs> and there's the kids' camp. There's it sounds like there's hundreds of kids over there. It's crazy. If they're all getting ready for bed and stuff. Okay, well, I guess we'll head to that portage over there. 120 meters to Sheriff Pond. Oh, lost my sandal. <laughs> I got it. Do you want me to go behind you or in front of you? You can go behind me. Then I can pick my own pace. Yeah. Yeah. First portage in years. There's a mess. It's all muck and mud. I think it's a beaver pond and I guess this dam broke or something because yeah it's a mess but we're gonna continue on to like for the next portage. So it looks like the next portage out of this lake is over there but with this lake dropping like three feet it's just muck. We have to literally get out I think and pull the canoe and I'm not doing that. So I think we're going to head back. Looks like people have canoed through there. Maybe give it one shot. Well, we made it after all. We're just going to walk the portage and check it out. We're not bringing the canoe any further. We're just going to leave it here. It's so mucky. Where's this beaver? It's got to do a better job. Look at this. Used to be lake bottom. Okay, 320 meters to Little Island Lake. We're just going to walk it and leave the canoe and see what it looks like. I think it's a little island because it has an island in the middle with campsites on it. That is the island that you can paddle all the way around and there's campsites on it. This looks like a cool little lake. Yeah. Just a bit of a challenge getting through that swampy pond. But it is 7.10 so we better start heading back.
We are back. One hour, three minutes total moving time for 5.26 kilometers. So cut that in half at like, what, 2.8? We were like 2.6 yeah, here, so I guess you're looking at about 5.5k from cash launch all the way over here to get to that little island lake. Yeah, there's the island. That would have been cool to go around. But we didn't have time. Looks like a fun one to stay on too. No motorboats out there. So beautiful. Good morning, everyone. Another peaceful day after this morning's rain. We're all packed up. We're going to go ahead to Lake of Two Rivers. And it's only a half an hour paddled out of here. Going back through the narrows. Where's all the moose at? Be a good spot for them right here. On the way back to Cache Lake. Thank you. We are back at the car. It was 33 minutes for our 2.7 kilometers. Pretty busy parking lot. Some people are on their way out, it appears. But 
please like and subscribe. Next video might be with Paul. We'll see. Check out his channel. Link below. Oh yeah. Nice little trip out there. It'd be nice to get a little further back next time to get away from all the motorboats. But all in all, can't complain. Weather cooperated pretty well besides some early morning rain, but that wasn't even that bad. But yeah, we're going off to Lake of Two Rivers. I've already filmed that place, so I'm not going to bother doing another video on there. You can check that out from last summer, 2020. But keep following along. See you next time.